Hello, everyone. Thank you for coming to the stream. Really, definitely appreciate you guys. Uh, getting my Skyrim pulled up, as you can see here. Uh, I am coming through. Okay, yeah, there we go. I, I figured that that song was uh, appropriate, considering... <laughs> I'm joining the Empire. And just so you guys know, I've decided I'm going to start uh, splitting up my streams a little bit. Basically, I'm going to be stopping it, changing the name of it, and starting it back up again. Uh, so, if the stream stops, you know what's going on there. I will say something, of course. I'm doing that mostly. That way, one, you don't have a... I don't, I'm not uploading a... Well, let's see. The last one of my streams was like six hours. Uh, so I'm not uploading a stream that long to, uh, YouTube as well as, um, they're actually more split up based on what I'm actually doing in-game. But anyways, let's go turn in the quest that I did last night. After I lo after I got in here, I realized, oh yeah, that's what I was going to do today. But hey, join in the Imperials' work. Why the heck do they put me on the other side of the freaking bridge? Poor Pavo and Gat, to have lived through a Forsworn attack. Good job. Yeah. Yeah, he's in here. You lost? No, I'm not lost. I'm coming here to tell you that your home is secure. Gat and I are the only survivors. Kolskiger mine is lost, friend. Forsworn killed everyone. You drove them off? By yourself? <laughs> Thank you. We'll head back to work right away. Take this. It's the least I can do. Ooh. Well, thank you. All right, then. <laughs> He's like, really? You did it? Oh, all right, then. May your next fight... Huh? Divine smile on you, friend. Stupid dog. They, uh, yeah, those Forsworn really are not very strong. And they don't scale very well with your level. Because their equipment simply sucks. <laughs> we need to do something about these vampire attacks. What vampire attacks? There's, like, been one. Then again, to be fair... It's not like the rest of the world's waiting on me to do things, unlike other places. In this world, people actually live their lives when I'm not in the area. Anyways, hello everybody. How you all doing? Give me that white cap. Am I actually coming through? Uh, 
Okay, I think Azura can hear me at least, so... There. And why are you dying? like 12 messages on telegram that I haven't read yet. Oops. Oh. Yeah. Skyrim, right? Skyrim is definitely a very interesting game when it comes to fall damage. Sometimes you can be falling and just hit the right slope to roll into a safe stop. And other times you fall like two feet and die. <laughs> oh, or Koosh. Koosh. Let's see how huh? I know that guy will pay me for this or but I kind of want it all. I have uses to put it to. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, hello, gold. Why is there a random pot in here? Okay. Eyes are creepy. There weren't many veins in this, uh, mine.
Alright, out of this mine since it's kind of useless now. The old mine had so much. It's like awesome, and that one was like. Mm. This land feels twisted. I'm surprised my father didn't want to live out here. What is it, Argonian? Oh, why would it be considered stealing? You work hard, Daigo. Glad you stayed with us. I'm grateful, Skaggy. I'm sorry my daughter gives you so much trouble. What if the Forsworn come here? We aren't safe. You've got a guard over there. Granted, that guard's as useful as, uh... <laughs> I am nobody's lapdog. It's not my fault that they that the votes went the way they did. Maybe you guys should go share the stream and stuff and get votes for Stormcloaks instead. I got a moment before I go to the Imperials. Rocks and valley, crevices and hiding places. This is the kind of place where hermits and fanatics dwell. Alright, first stop I am going to go to my house. Oh, by the way, hi, Moro. <laughs> oh, wait, I've got a new house that I should go to. and your creepy eyes. Oh, where's my other house? There it is. Let's move faster. The sun is... It's not great for my skin, if you know what I mean. Wow, I got a lot of uh, gold ore. I need a lot of firewood. And nails.
Really? They they include quarried stone, but they won't use my logs. Well, thank you, Serana, for sweeping my home. You're weird. What do I have back here? Ooh. I'm tempted. Quarried stone and firewood, looks like. Well, I can build that at least. Where's the beds? I need some of those. Beds. Now where did that display go? Does that matter where the heck is this trophy room? That is a really cool th display. By the way, this is a modded home, if you guys didn't know. Seriously, where is this trophy room? So, you have attained full Dragonborn status. Being shouted at by a group of old men has never been so rewarding. Oh my god. Really? No, my mind is as empty as a beggar's purse. I love Inigo so much. Well, I guess if there's nothing more to do, then let's go join the Imperials! I love it when dinner warms up. Engage your attack. I'm a little bit 
busy at the moment. I've got all sorts of enemies. No, I have not. I will have to go check it out right now. I'm new too. The Winking Skeever. Charming name. Warm beds. You look like an adventurous one. I bet we're kindred spirits, you and I. You're passing through solitude? Maybe you're looking to make some easy gold, yes? It's easy to find things to sell. Things nobody will miss. Things from underground, or just left lying around in someone's house. I bet the two of us were very alike. So why not take the next step? My sister Deja and I are treasure hunters. We like to collect things. I knew you looked like a clever one. Inigo is a with mod. War, many more ships come through these docks, loaded with weapons and pay, but few people, and they pass through dangerous waters. We have an interest in one of those boats, the Ice Runner. The Solitude Lighthouse will be guiding it in. But if its fire were to go out, the Ice Runner would run aground. What an interesting idea. I think if someone were to do something like that, there would definitely be a certain amount of loot to be shared. Yes, if someone were to put out the lighthouse fire and then meet me on the docks afterwards, I could certainly direct them to that loot. Don't worry about them. We'll make sure they wash up safe. Maybe they'll even pay us for the heroic rescue from their sad crash. Turn me in? For what? What crime's been committed? I'm just making idle talk about what would most undoubtedly be a tragic event. A tragic and very, very profitable event. This is an ode to Skyrim's staunch protectors, the Imperials. We drink to our youth, to the days It would be best if we spoke little the until you've completed of aggression this task. Is, just about done. is that supposed to be dancing? We'll drive out the storm cloaks and restore what we own. With our blood and our steel, You we talk will to Malborn. I will keep an eye out for Thalmor spies. Oh yeah, I'm supposed to meet that person here. On the day of your death, we will drink Ask away. We'll sing. Good idea. You should take a break too. You deserve it. I've always been a part of the Red Wave crew for a few weeks. Sometimes tedious. I've already but a well-made arrow Captain strikes Sy forth like the fury ship of a the Argent Raptor. She struck an iceberg and went down just north of Windhelm. Of the scourge that has sullied our hopes and our dreams. I have no business with you. Leave me. And with Ulfric, the killer of kings. <sighs> On the day of your death, we will drink and we'll sing. Yes, my friend. He didn't sit at a table. I've never tried winking at a skiver before. I usually just slay them on sight and save the subtle body language. For the ladies. <laughs> really? <laughs> I'm thinking I'm a little tired. You lead, I follow. Let's try moving. Yeah, that's what I figured I'd do. What is on your mind? Of course, what do you want to know? Why not? Let me know when you are ready to move on. Alright. Where the heck are you going? Really? You're gonna sit in the one chair. The one chair 
that I can't sit on a tree. Oh my god. That looks like a really big coin purse. Our hero, our hero, paints a warrior's heart. What is on your mind? I tell you, I my tell father you always said alcohol is not the answer, but it does make you forget the question. Oh, jeez. I guess I better stand up then. To the evil of all Skyrim's foes. Beware. I wonder beware when they last cleaned their mugs here. Comes. For the darkness has passed and the legend yet uh -huh. grows. You'll know you have my you full attention. Comes. Why not? Let me know when you are ready to move on. Sit here, please. Or right there. Perfect! Finally! What is on your mind? Oh, hey! I can ask him all sorts of things. Yes. I have never been very good, though. I enjoy writing songs, but sometimes it is more fun just making up words as I go along. We Improvisation keeps the mind sharp the and boredom at bay. And For the age of aggression is just about done. Maybe, we'll but nothing too serious. I would rather save my proper songs for the Bard's College. For now, anyway. Well, I know it is silly, but my songs are special to me. I would rather perform them in a special place. However, if you just want me to improvise something while we are traveling, maybe I can help you out. We will see. Okay, now he's probably going to start singing at some point. Oh, this is going to be glorious. You want a performance review? Okay. <laughs> okay. I will list some of your attributes. Here we go. You smell good. You are okay for gold at the moment. Every now and then you become a stick chasing bottom sniffer. I am a tree climbing fur licker. Each to their own. You what? You've never done time in a cell. Unlike me. Your travels have taken you to a few interesting places, but much of Skyrim is still a mystery to you. You own your own home. That is a big positive in my book. Eh, uh, let me think. If you insist on fighting with magic, may I suggest more practice? I do not want to be unconscientiously scorched. <laughs> you are healthy. Try to stay that way. You have been known to influence people's decisions with a mix of body language and craftiness. You are strong, free, and single. You can hold your own with a one-handed weapon. There is always more to be learned, though. In life, you tend to go your own way. You do not follow the herd. You have great fashion sense. Uh, let's see. Two-handed weapons do not seem to suit you. I feel the same way. They are heavy and cumbersome. You are not into politics. More often than not, you are polite and sincere. You are becoming sneaky, but there is still a lot of room for improvement. You enjoy a book from time to time. Reading has increased your knowledge. What have I missed? Oh, you are quite the marksman. Still not a patch on me, of course, but very good nonetheless. Really? Now, how do I conclude? You are becoming a first-rate adventurer, my friend. Good thing, too. There are still many dangers you are yet to be tested against. That is that. I hope you enjoyed my insight. So, basically... He's my Professor Oak for evaluating my Pokedex. <laughs> Although, a lot more thorough of my adventure. Okay, 
But remember, I am not a professional writer. I hope you like it. Inigo the Brave, a tale suitable for any gender and race at any time. One day, Inigo was walking through his spider farm, minding his own business, spider when he farm? smelt something was wrong. His nose was the best in the land, so he followed it to a nearby cave, where he found a beautiful woman of unspecified race crying. What's wrong, said Inigo. A smelly troll stole my sister, said the radiant woman. Can you help me? Please bring her back. Inigo looked into the dark cave, then into the eyes of the woman. If she's alive, I will save your sister, he said. Thank you, wept the woman. She kissed him, and he entered the cave, bow in hand. He could smell ugly troll everywhere. He soon came to a fork in the tunnel. A little stream ran to the left, and a patch of glowing moss illuminated the way to the right. Left or right. Oh, so it's a uh, choose-your-own-adventure book? <laughs> um, I don't know. What do you guys say? Left or right? YouTube picked, well, actually, Azura, you picked the opposite way just to be a problem, didn't you? Oh, well. <laughs> I guess there's a uh, time limit on that. What is he doing now? Drive out the storm cloaks and restore what we own. With our blood and our steel, we will take He decided to change seats. What is on your mind? Sorry, legs. Break's over. On the day of your death, we will drink and we'll sing. Ah, eh, we'll come back to it another time. It's time! They say if a vampire so much as scratches you, you'll turn into one. That better not be true. Is it? I'm telling you, Ulfric's planning an attack on White Run. He'd be insane to try. He doesn't have the men. That's not what my scouts report, sir. Every day more join his cause. Riften, Dawnstar, and Winterhold support him. Are my men now giving free reign to anyone who wanders into the castle? Do you have some reason to be here, citizen? Fine. Why don't you have a chat with Legate Ricca? I suspect we might have use for someone resourceful like you. It's not a cause. It's a rebellion. Call it whatever you like, General. The man's going to try to take Whiterun. Jarl Balgruff. I've got a good feeling about you, and I don't often get good feelings about anything. A warrior knows to trust her gut. I'm not going to go <laughs> through the normal process with you. I've got a little test lined up. Pass that, and we'll talk about you joining the Legion. The kind that evaluates your usefulness during duress. 
I'm sending you to clear out Fort Haragstad. If you survive, you'll pass. If you die, then I'll have no further use for your corpse. The Ancients built many of the fortresses that dot the landscape of Skyrim. Sadly, most have fallen into disrepair, and nearly all have been overrun with bandits or other vagabonds. Fort Haragstad is one of the few that remains mostly intact. We're going to install a garrison there, but first, you're going to clean out the bandits that have moved in. Good, that's what I want to hear. Now go make it happen, soldier. Balgruf refuses the Legion's right to garrison troops in his city. On the other hand, he also refuses to acknowledge Ulfric's claim. Well, if he wants to stand outside the protection of the Empire, fine. Let Ulfric pillage his city. General. You people and your damn Jarls. Sir, you can't force a Nord to accept help he hasn't asked for. If Ulfric's making a move for Whiterun, then we need to be there to stop him. Draft another letter with the usual platitudes, but this time she... Best offense is a good defense, am I right? Alright, so... I guess it's official, maybe? I don't know. But let's go clear out this fort. Where is it? Over there? Ugh. Oh, I suppose. All right. So Where's my... Yeah, I'll leave my horse. Oh, for a second there, I thought I had two Saranas following me. Because the guard had his hood on as well. Oh, hi! need to get the dual whatever you call it anything else the music still plant okay there we go of course there's never a guard around when you need one Hey, Ray! Welcome! Good to see you! Alright, let's see here... I can never figure out how to get up to that higher road. At least the proper way. Oh, good! You're just in time to watch me sell my soul to the Empire. I realize I need to go up, but there are horses down there. 
Oh. Crap. If you know any true son, Talos guide you. Okay, good. They don't think I'm Imperial yet. Maybe if I go to Dragon Bridge instead, start from there. All right, horse, you behave this time. There we go. There would. Another My horse is quite the combatant. Who are you? A important deliveries to make. No time for chatting. temple lying in ruins. So much for the constancy of mortals, their crafts and their hearts. If oh. they love me not, how can my love reach them? Let's go this way. I'm not wanting to do that quest just yet. to go this way. Fort I'm supposed to take. Where's Let the... me give you some room. Let me give you some room. Where's the quest marker? Really? 
I really dislike that there is this maximum distance on here. Where'd you come from? Oh, don't mind me, I'm just looting. Yes, yes it really is. Oh, am I in the middle of combat? But there's loot. And that's what having multiple followers is great for. I get to enjoy my loot. They get to do the dirty work. Everybody wins, right? Your imagination created a bolt sticking out of you, too. Nobody but me. Aha. Uh -huh. Now let me go loot this person. Where'd you come from? Me. Oh, they're not out there. What the frick? Ah! 
the heck? Uh. Yes, personal pack meals. Though, I have to say, Inigo, he's not a pack meal. He's a friend. Now, Serana, on the other hand, she kind of invited herself to my party. Incessantly magnificent. I know. Just look at this. I mean, this isn't the greatest of views, but still. Skyrim really is a beautiful game. Serana, what the fuck are you doing? I don't care. Nope. I'm not getting paid enough for that. So, come to think of it, am I getting paid at all? I think she might... The lady that gave me this, uh might be considering this my civic duty or something. I better get paid. I want my money. Okay, so I got this entrance or that one. Yeah, I'll go in the main one. Oh, hi! Oh, what? No! Well, crap. Seriously? Okay, this is not going well. Bad time. Um. Oh yes, I could use that. And I'll use this. Oh, that's my. That is not my sword. So. Where'd you come Ah. And I just announced myself to the entire freaking place. <laughs> but hey, at least I'm alive. I never remember about my shouts, and more often than not, they kind of get me into more trouble than anything. They really, truly do. Like right there. Could have taken care of that person nice and quietly, but no! I shouted and announced my presence to the entire fort in a big thunderous voice. You know what? I took care of them. That's all that matters.
Now, this guy's got some cool armor. I'll forget it. I'll take it all. Inigo! Uh -huh. Help! No. My mind is a tree without leaves at the moment. You have something to say? Okay. Let us see what we have. Oh no. I want this. to take that back. You keep using that circlet. Oh god, no. I wish I could just tell my follower, hey, wear this, not that. I got something in here instead. Oh yeah, that's heavy. Those are kind of heavy. Oh, 24 pounds of iron ore. Yeah, that would be heavy. Let us go. Potion, potion, potion. Hello? Beep. Hello! Hi. And how are you, little Eclipse? Good, I'm eating a burger. Bastard. I want a burger. It's a good burger. Gee, thanks. Just rub it in, why don't you? And it came with the really skinny, crispy fries. Those I can make. I have fries here. I am definitely rather broke though, so yeah, no no burgers for me. Though, because I work for Starbucks, I get plenty of gift cards for Starbucks that I get to enjoy. I am sipping a peach black tea lemonade. You work for Starbucks now? Yes. I've been working for them for a few months. 
And their oh. customer service department. Okay. So if that was so quick and easy, what the Who's heck's there? in here? I knew I heard something. Done and done. Ow. <laughs> and the fight's completely over before the stream even catches up. At least on my end. Nope. All your friends are safe. They're still alive. No combat. So, I discovered something. 42. No. 69? Apparently I bought Destiny. I didn't know I did. Destiny. That's that really bad... We're trying to be popular again without Halo game, right? Yeah. From Bungie, that's right. That's the developer's name. It was in my PlayStation inventory, but I don't even remember. I bought it too. I mean, it was kind of hyped to all hell. I mean, seriously. It was so hyped. Well, it's like one of the biggest budget games ever made. <laughs> and people expected great things out of it because, hey, this is Bungie. And, at least in my opinion, they kind of fell flat on their faces with it. Oh, well, thanks for coming. Hope you enjoyed yourself. Hope to see you again, too. <laughs> this is just my opinion, anyways. Holy crap. I've never played it, but gameplay looks okay. Maybe they've had updates to make it better since last time. I figured since it's already in there, I might as well give it a try. Yeah, it, it's a good game. My problem with it uh, is the fact that it felt very much like playing an MMO, in that it was grinding. Except, not in a way... You would wind up having to do the same quest like 30 times to get leveled up enough to do the next quest. I think my biggest issue with it is that it wasn't available on PC. Yeah, that's definitely uh, another factor, but looking at the game itself... I hate playing shooters on consoles. Yeah, you just can't beat the mouse. I'm sorry, you can't. Keyboard mouse master race. PC Master Race. Multi-platform gods. I need to get a sticker that says PC Master Race. Well, not just says that, but yeah. Did that? Don't you know the gaming hierarchy? You have the multi-platform monarchy, the PC gaming nobles, then you have the console knights, and then the mobile gaming peasants. Where do 3DS players fall into that? Probably console knight. This is really just a portable console. Fair enough. 
Hands to yourself, sneak thief. No game on the Nintendo DS that I would play, so I didn't get one. Oh, I play all sorts of games, mostly Fire Emblem. I really like Fire Emblem. Uh, Epic, was that, uh... So, Activision was involved with Destiny? I think they were the publisher. Really? I thought they would, I thought they did it on their own. But then again, I suppose Activision's not EA where they make sure that their logo is practically the only thing you see with oh yeah, the actual developer on the side. Yeah. Developed by Bungie and published by Activision. Huh. Wow, good to know. This is my kind of place. Destiny 2 release date. Hello and welcome, my friend. How may I help you on this fine day? Why, of course. And will you also be needing the bow that Bungie you has bow? huge official or reveal at the PlayStation Experience 2016. Look, if you want arrows, huh. we have them. But don't insult my intelligence. What are you talking about, your intelligence? I need arrows that can take down a dragon! I guess he doesn't believe they exist. Take a look. Yeah, you're definitely uh, right on that. Destiny, the gameplay was great. The problem is, is that the story was like, they throw you in there without any background. And no, I'm like, funny. have said fun! Story. He said that as if Destiny even had a story to begin with. <laughs> It's supposed to it's have... All, it's all just really vague shit that nothing really explained. It just says something magic happened that called magic things to happen and magic, the end. Yeah, kind of the idea that I've been getting about it. Why do you think I haven't played it in forever? I really don't like Microsoft taking away the ability to, uh... It wasn't non-existent. It was there. Just could have been a thousand times better. It was really vague stuff. Yes. You'll get you no argument create... from me on that. You try to create like a new world where everybody would love to explore and experience and learn about, but then you don't give them anything to learn about it. Yeah, basically. I'm not, I'm definitely not saying it was a good game by any means. Where did I get these? Yeah, I heard you had to do a bunch of extra bullshit though to get the cards. You had to enter codes on a website or something. Yeah, the... That's another thing about it. It's like, hey, you can play our game. Yeah, it's got a story, more. but you got to go online to see it. Remember exploration. I don't. You what?
Oh. Either way, it's not in the game is the problem. Plus, they kind of... Tell me again why I'm wasting men chasing after a fairy tale. Uh, if no. Ulfric I'll gets his hand on that crown, it won't be a fairy tale. It'll be a problem. Don't you Nords put any stock in your own traditions? I thought the Moot chose the king. We're backing Elisif. When the Moot meets, they'll do the sensible thing. Not everyone's agreed to the Moot. You've been here long enough to know that Nords aren't always sensible. We follow our hearts. So what? Ulfric gets this crown and then suddenly he's High King? No, it's not as simple as that. But the Jagged Crown would be a potent symbol for his cause to rally around. But if we found it first... And we gave it to Elisif. In the absence of the moot, it would further legitimize her claim. Perhaps. I'm entrusting you with what resources I can spare. But I'm warning you, if this turns out to be a waste of time and men... It won't be a waste. Make sure you take the auxiliary here. You can send him back when you get there and find nothing but old bones and cobwebs. The Stone Fist's no fool. He's found the crown, but we'll get to it first. Welcome back, soldier. I'm glad you made it in one piece. I'll send men to garrison the fort right away. You did well. I'm impressed. But before we go any further, it's time for you to officially join the Legion. Speak with General Tullius. He'll administer the oath. In joining the Legion, you'll be taking an oath binding you to the service of the Emperor... Something ...and to thus report? to every citizen of the Empire. We need the Rift. We need to regain control of it before we can march on Windhelm without worry about our rear guard. The hmm. General and I have our disagreements, but he's the best hope for both the Empire and Skyrim. Changed your mind? Decided you wanted to soldier for the Empire after all. Well then, repeat after me. Upon my honor, I do swear undying loyalty to the Emperor, Titus Mead II. Moro, the votes were clear. And unwavering obedience to the officers of his great empire. May those above judge me, and those below take me, if I fail in my duty. Long live the Emperor, long live the Empire. Welcome to the Imperial Legion, soldier. Just remember, we take care of our own. Once you're in the Legion, you're in it for life. Speak to Baron. He's normally out by the forge. He'll get you outfitted. Now, if I'm not mistaken, Legate Ricca has a special assignment for you. Too late, Moro. Sorry. Okay. I'm gonna, um, release me. Well, any moment now. Hi again, Ikrit. By the way, uh, for Welcome you to, to know Legion and Auxiliary. others. Listen up. Um. Welcome to the Legion Auxiliary. Oh, more story. Listen up. Ulfric's right-hand man, Galmar Stonefist, has located what he believes is the final resting place of the Jagged Crown. We're going to make sure he doesn't get his hands on it. The rest of my men are already assembling outside Corvin June. I'll meet you there as soon as I finish up here. A legendary crown dating back to King Harald's time or before. A powerful relic of a golden age, long since past. 
Legend has it that the crown is made from the bones and teeth of ancient dragons, and is said to increase the power of the wearer. Whatever the truth, if Ulfric gets his hands on it, it would be a powerful symbol around which to rally support for his cause. Well, to be frank, we don't. Its location was lost with King Borgus, when the Great Hunt killed him off while on his Lushen campaigns. Supposedly, his body was brought back to Skyrim and secretly buried with the crown. Knowledge of that location was lost in the Wars of Secession. But my agents report that Galmar is pretty damn convinced Corvin June is the tomb of King Borgus. I know Galmar. We fought in many wars together. He's not a sentimental man taken to fancy. If he believes the crown is there, he's likely found it. Don't wait for me. Get to Corvin June as soon as you're ready. I'll meet you there. Okay. I set a hotkey to mute uh, Discord as if when I'm have enough outsiders. Now we've got doing a story from here. Strutting about. Look at that. All right, so yes, if I didn't get an answer, yeah, sorry. Uh, what'd you ask? <laughs> Ragan wants me to join her uh, Discord chat. Someday soon, you will all see bad Ragan does. What you do here today, Ragan. Really? Oh, Ragged. Yeah, he's welcome. No, I'm going over there. <laughs> no! Bring him over yeah. here! He's in a group already. So? Which one's better? Gonna play stupid freaking Overwatch again. If you don't want to play it, then don't play it. What? What? If you don't like it, don't play it! Okay. And stay here. But you said if I don't like it, don't play it. And I also said to stay here. You're not playing me. Or am I? Better not be. Wait, the embers here? The battlefield is full of distractions. No, Ignore. probably not. Focus on your targets. Okay, where is this? Arms or armor you need, see Bayrand in Castle Dower. Bloody good blacksmith, that one. Okay. Where's this blacksmith guy. I'm in. The battlefield is full of distractions. Ignore them. Focus on your target. What is it? Dragons? Ew, the Thalmor. Hate the Thalmor. Who doesn't hate the Thalmor? I don't know. I want to meet one person who actually likes the Thalmor. I used to be an adventurer like you. Hail companion. Mind yourself in my city, friend. This here axe in full swing is a right terrible sight. Okay, that's the dungeon. I'm pretty sure the blacksmith's not in the dungeon. I'm waiting. Is he in the dungeon? When am I going to be trusted enough to just loot all this? Trouble. Why 
Why would you want Imperial armor? Best defense is a good defense. Am I right? Okay. You I don't care about the armor. The Castle Dower dungeon can break even the strongest will. Oh, there. Mm -hmm. Oh, no, that's... Oh, yes, it is. Okay. Seems there's no end to the needs of the Imperials. But what can I help you with? Hey, yep. I just have one question for you. Light, medium, or heavy? They don't make finer steel anywhere else. If this doesn't keep you from dying, nothing will. Now that's it. One free outfit per soldier. You lose that, or get it banged up. You'll need to pay like everyone else. It's almost all I have time for these days. I can't the men buy training anything from here you? in solitude, and the troops out in the field. They all need weapons and armor. But I'm not telling you anything you don't already know. Hello, Quigs! Uh, to be honest, no. But High King Torrig supported them. And now, her lady Elisif has thrown in with them. You could say I'm a king's man at heart. Mm. I guess that's Yarrow's man now. My loyalty lies. I need to take so a shower. So All right, go have fun. Yarl Elisip leads. I talk to Ragged for a bit. Then go take a shower. All right. And anytime you need arms Good night. or armor, my forge All right. never rests. I might go back in later. Okay. Watch what you're doing. Okay, let's check out this heroic armor. Oh. Most of it is better than what I've got already. Crud. I like my wolf armor. Meh. Okay, next stop. Let's see, what should I do next? I don't really want to go do that yet. Uh, no. Yeah, I'm going to finish up my leg ball. Uh, guys, I'm going to stop the stream real quick. And restart it with a new title.